Disclaimer! This show and video is meant for older audiences. Warnings will be in the description and viewer discretion is advised. Object shows are very weird. Just the basic idea of everyone being an object for no reason is weird enough already, but most of them are pretty normal all things considered. Basic competitions with uninteresting casts, harmless stuff. But not this show. Bone Zone is a new object show and it terrifies me. We follow Funny Bone as he figures out he is in hell. His personal hell being that he can't host an object camp. Truly some horrifying stuff. He decides to defy the laws of everything and break out of his personal hell and runs across hell to pitch his object camp as a show to the hell TV stations. During his journey, there's lots of insane stuff that happens. We see some of the citizens of hell yelling at him for asking them to join his show, eating a giant corpse of some monster. Inside the TV station, it cuts through a ton of shots of him going through the studio, gasping the whole time, as we see a TV show where if you get a question wrong, you get FIVE MILLION LASHES! It's all very crude and insane, but it's also pretty funny. The art style most reminds me of Pizza Tower, somewhat crudely drawn, but it remains consistent and well animated, and allows for very funny expressions and poses. Finally, Funny Bone reaches the place where he needs to pitch his show, and does so very poorly. He wants to host a competition to torture the contestants, promising that he will also physically torture them. The person in charge agrees to let him make the show. Then she does cocaine. Also, if he fails to make the show good, he will become her eternal sex slave. This show is horrifying. That's just the pilot though. The next episode picks right up where the last one ended. They're discussing if they can have the grand prize of the show be a second chance at life. The boss of the studio says she needs to ask Satan. Then the couch Funny Bone is sitting on comes to life and wants him to sit on him more. This show... I don't even know what to say, but he sniffs him on the way out. So that's great. From here we meet the contestants. A colorful array of people who are in hell. The location of the competition is on an island on Earth. The group of people trying to survive as they don't know why they have been brought back from hell. Here we get a good scan of their personalities. Sock is overly nervous. Leaf is blind and chill. Kite is an asshole. I won't go every single one, but they do a good job characterizing them and showing how some would definitely be bad enough to go to hell. Which leaves me interested in how some of the nicer contestants ended up there. Marshmallow is also hilarious, his joke being that he thinks he is a manly man and offers to do things he is incapable of doing. Whenever he volunteers, it starts playing this generic manly music. It's funny stuff. Then finally, Funny Bone arrives. Getting the contestants together, he explains that they are in a competition. The first challenge will be to compete for the right to have Kite on one of their teams. This being because of the uneven amount of players. Sadly, the episode cuts off here, as it's only episode 1A, meaning the rest will come out next time. Overall, the show is pretty funny, even if most object fans won't be able to watch it due to the concept and material within the show. But if you at all enjoy dark comedy, I recommend it. Lots of it isn't hilarious, but was enough to make me chuckle, or at least be entertained. I also think Funny Bone is one of the best hosts in a while. Unlike most hosts who are overly confident and actually have godly powers, Funny Bone is an overconfident guy who gets sent to the bottommost part of hell, getting his memories erased, and is purely at the whims of the hell higher-ups. I enjoy him so much more than other hosts because he really just wants to host a funny show, and his attitude is more like a lovable, confident person rather than an egotistical jerk. Considering this, I hope you will be able to bounce off the contestants well, as he did with the boss of the TV station, as well as maybe even connecting with them. While I don't suspect this show to take any part of itself seriously, the idea that as the show goes on, the more Funny Bone doesn't want these people to go back to hell, resulting in him becoming a better person as well, is an interesting place to explore, even if somewhat basic. Regardless, the first episodes are pretty good, and set a good tone and bar for quality to come. I recommend it as long as you're old enough and are okay with dark comedy. Well, that was me, Golden Archetype, and stay gold everyone, stay gold. Thank you.